Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I'm on the couch with the two stinking dogs, and uh, we've got another little update and unboxing for you. This one's the big bad update. So, right off the bat, why is this the big bad update? Why is this the big bad update video? Um, well, let's start with some good news to soften the blow. <laughs> the good news is it's spring-ish. Um, in the past three days, our yard has it was like 75% covered and has melted. Now there's just a few patches of snow. It was like 65 for two days and just sunny, and it just melted. And uh, now we can see that we, you know, it was sunny out. Did some yard work out there, raking, cleaning up the loads of dog poop because we've had lot, they've had lots of friends over, and yeah, there's just a minefield of poop. There's a lot more poop out there. It's all big poop. So, yeah, clean lots of poop. We've got to get rid of that creepy little dollhouse in the backyard. I don't know what to do with that thing. We're getting rid of it. Uh, I don't need it, but yeah. Uh, anyways, yeah, so, so snow's melting, spring's here, ice is open, or lakes are open. And now for the bad news. The bad news is... Well, first off, I had to cancel a camping trip this week. Um because most of the places I like to go camping, canoe camping, fishing overnighting, it's not legal to spend the night out there by myself right now. Yeah, um, I have very limited options for camping. I'm gonna get out this week. Um, I've been talking to people about private property and there's a few places I can go. Um, I've been monitoring fire bans um, so I, I can totally understand not having a fire. I, I get that um, in, in the, you know, where, when there's a fire ban. Um, but not being able to go by myself in the woods, I don't understand. So yeah, like I said, I've been talking to a few people. So I've got some places I can go and that, that should be good to go. And, uh, you know, but I can't do what I want to do the most right now in my favorite place to go camping in the world. I can't go there and it doesn't seem like it's going to open up for a while here. Uh, so that kind of makes me upset and there's nothing I can do about it. My hands are tied. And as far as my week long trip goes in spring, I don't know about that till tomorrow. So let's cross our fingers. Tomorrow we find out if it's going to be on or off. Um, yeah. So we're getting affected by the whole thing a little bit and it's, uh, Frankly, it sucks. It sucks. So this week, I should be going out and doing a little bushcrafting. That's the plan anyways. Um, don't know if I'll be able to have a fire, but we are still going to cook because I'll just bring out my stoves if I can't. Um, yeah, and then after that, we'll see. I'm, I'm just going to you know, keep an eye out. and I, should, I, I do know where I can go with certain places. Certain places are off limits. It's just all a big poop is what it is. But anyways, you know, got that. I think what I might start doing here is uh, I've got, with this house here, I've got a, just a couple acres here, and I've actually got a patch of woods in the back corner there. And I think what I'm going to do eventually here is right now it's a big mound of, like, topsoil and dirt from gardens and stuff that have just been piled up. It's just a big pit pile of junk and, like, rocks and trees and lumber and nails and... I'm going to clean all that up and I think we're going to do a little bushcraft shelter on my house so that I can do like update videos like this with trees in the background. It'll just be right in my backyard over there, but it'll be better than the couch and uh, you know, it might not be as easy to keep these guys around unless I've got T-R-E-A-T-S, you know, but uh, yeah, I think that's the plan, especially with this all going on. Uh, I was thinking about maybe... If I can't get out camping, spending the night out in my backyard there, but I don't think I could do that. I don't like, I don't think I could sleep out there knowing that my bed is like a hundred feet away. I don't know. I, I spend too much time out in the, you know, the woods farther away from people. I don't think I have it in me to just camp in the backyard for the sake of a video. I, I just can't do it. I just couldn't do it. I wouldn't, it wouldn't feel the same. Wouldn't be right. Especially because, dang nabbit. They're holding me back. I should be fine. My free spirit. At least I want to be. 
<sighs> so yeah, anyways, like I said, I'm a rule follower, so I can't knowingly go out and do something I know is against rules, so I'm finding any gotta put on gotta put on my little my little thinking cap and I do I've, I've looked through and from what I've seen I know a spot I can go a couple places there's a few places that are on limits a lot of my favorite places are off limits so but anyways let's that's just I'm gonna get out camping still and I'm gonna try to build a shelter I just really want to go to my or I want to go canoe camping. I do know one spot I can go canoe camping. Um, right now there's still snow in the way, but uh, yeah, my favorite place that I could probably go catch trout right now. I'm not allowed to. Okay, I'm gonna stop complaining. We're gonna stop talking about this. We're gonna get over it. Time will go on. We'll get past this. <laughs> Anyways, I'm just a little upset about that. Anyways, I don't think there's anything else to talk about really. That was just, that's it. That's, that's the roughest part. Don't tell me I can't spend the night in the woods. Who do they think they are, Monty? Huh? Root? Who are they to say that I can't just go sleep in the woods? Being all peaceful, one with the nature. Anyways, okay, enough ranting, done. We got some gifts we're gonna unbox. I know a couple of these, but uh, yeah. Let's do some unboxing, boys. I know you guys are always excited. At first, you're confused. I think they're starting to, like, understand now that, like, this couch and with the crutches here. Want this? Want this? Package number one? Okay. So, I think I know who sent this one. This is from the Blackout Coffee Co. I bet I can just rip this open. I think I know what this is. It is coffee. Oh, there's a note in here, I think, or something. Da, 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 da. Okay, it's ground coffee from the Blackout Coffee Co. And I'm pretty sure I know who sent this. Um, let's see what we got here. Blackout Coffee, ground, fresh roasted morning reaper. Mmm. I like my coffee. I've been drinking a lot of tea since I did that two-week cleanse, and that's over with. Completed it. We picked out on ribs the other day as like a celebratory cheat meal, but other than that, still eating healthy, but I, coffee's back. I, I, I made the switch to tea for two weeks, and I love tea. Tea is great. Tea is easy to drink, and it's delicious, but after that two weeks and I came back to coffee, I remember why I like coffee so much <laughs> over tea. They're both good. I love them both. Anyways, okay, let's we're gonna brew some of this up. Yeah. But I think it was Dr. Bay, so thank you very much for the coffee. Um let's open this up. We're gonna brew some right now. I'm gonna smell this. Oh yeah, that smells like some good stuff. Okay. Brew this up. Rugus. Rugistus Tugistus. Monty, you're being a good boy. Rugus is just getting antsy. Come on, Rugus. Come on now. Come on. Come on. Okay, yeah, so thanks you once again. We're gonna brew that up, taste it. Um, we're gonna do a little light uh, light brew, so I'll make some weaker coffee because uh, you know when I when I want my caffeine, I'll just make a big old strong coffee, but I wanna, I wanna taste it and I don't it's you know it's late in the afternoon. Yeah. Anyways, thanks again. Let's open up another rin. This one says fragile. It is from Anthony. In Hawaii. Oh, Hawaii. Mahalo. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Looks so like we've got a letter from Anthony to Matthew. Love the videos you do and also like the dogs in the videos. How is my writing? Haha, ha, keep it up. Writing is fine. Better than mine. <laughs> All right, so thank you, Anthony. We've got some uh, Dream Bone Healthy Alternative to Rawhide, and they're Christmas. Dog chews with vegetables and chicken. All right, boys. We're going to give them one each. Uh, I'm going to make a prediction 
Monty will chew on his for a bit, get disinterested, maybe, and then just wait for something that he can just swallow and just annihilate with his mouth and eat up. Ruger will chew it to bits and love it because this this guy's the he's the chewer. What do we got here? Mmm, smells like dog stuff. All right, we've got a Christmas tree. <laughs> Ooh, a gingerbread man. Which one do you guys want? Where you want the gingerbread man? There you go. Good boy. You want the tree? The tree? Go ahead. It's, like it's going too far. We need something else. <laughs> All right. So thank you once again, Anthony. Bunty. Ah. There you go. We'll see if he just. Dad, it won't stay in my mouth. Would you please just keep helping me out? If you drop it again, Monty, you're you're on your own. Okay. So next we've got a package from ALS.com. Returns. I think I know what this one is too. There's a couple things that people said they sent me, and I just you know I open these in batches, been letting them sit. Oh. Oh, I know what this is. Ho oh. <laughs> ho. All right, so we've got. Oh well, this is just. There's no letter in here. Oh yeah. So we've got a Neo Air Trekker. This is the exact sleeping pad that I always use. Awesome. And if you know. I've recently destroyed quite a few pads. We've been having lots of issues. Like I was saying, he's... Oh no! What could have caused a hole? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> So, this is going to be going out this week because I am still waiting to get my other pads back. It usually takes a few months when you send them in. Uh, there's no need to blow this up. I want to. Is this the... Uh... Awesome. These are not cheap. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, I'm not going to blow it up right now. I'm not going to be fighting Monty with it because we're taking a little break from that. But anyways, yeah. I can't remember who sent this to me. I read a lot of comments. But anyways, thank you very much. This will be going out this week. And hopefully it doesn't meet a terrible fate. But yeah, I love these thermo pads. I just need to treat them better. Okay, we've got ourselves an Amazon. Oh, let's get this, let's go with this, this littler one. From B, I won't say your last name, B. It's gonna be Bob or Billy, Barbara. It's gotta be one of those names. Blake, Bridget, Barney, Bruce. One of those names, it's gotta be. What do we got here? Okay, Matthew, we've got a postcard with a turtle on it, tortoise, Barb, that was close, Barbara, yeah, anyways, hello Matthew, okay, so Barb has started making ferro rods and wants me to use and abuse the crap out of it and see how it holds up. And she said she knows in my hands the poor thing will truly be tested. <laughs> so thank you very much for the letter. Let's see what we got here. Oh, it's, it's wrapped pretty good. 
I mean, if you want me to abuse it, I'll abuse it. Ooh, that's a fancy, that's like a marble, it's like a nice, I don't, I don't wanna, I don't. Looks pretty solid. Is that some kind of poly? That looks really nice. That's a nice looking fire sale. Yeah, I'll definitely give this a shot. And uh, I, I mean, I don't be, I don't just like beat my stuff up for no reason. Like it just sits in a bag. I'm not gonna like whip it against trees or like slam it against my ax. But yeah, I'll, I'll use it. But I think it looks pretty cool. It's definitely the fanciest ferro rod handle I have seen or held in my hand. Sweet. And she said she made it chartreuse because that's what I say a lot. And yeah, I, chartreuse is my favorite color lure. Um, as far as like dog colors go, Monty's like the blue guy and Ruger's the green because I like blue and Funk likes green this color. So like that's that's kind of our, we've always done that with our color schemes. But yeah, I still love this color. Blue and green is like water and land, trees and water, like my favorite colors. But yeah, anyways, thank you very much. That's a nice little fire rod there. Yeah. Yeah, Monty. Yeah. What do you got your... Did you guys eat those? Okay. I thought those were going to be like... I thought those were going to be like raw hides and not just get swallowed. That was like they just got a monster treat. Jeez, you guys. Oh, okay, we've got an Amazon package. Come on boys, up up, let's up up, let's up up, let's up up, okay. Let's come right here, right here. What's this, what's this? I don't got nothing. I don't got nothing. Well, I got you excited about nothing, huh? Yeah, yeah I did. Maybe there's something excited, exciting for you in here, maybe it's for me, who knows? Oh boys. Oh, boys, it's for you. It's for you, boys. All right, we've got a letter here. So it says, hi, Monty and Ruger. Um, so it says to not say where they're from or their names, I believe is what this letter says. So you know who you are. Thank you very much. Uh, what we got here is... Oravet Dental Hygiene Shoes. Right, boys? Here's my three. So these shoes right here, these are the exact shoes that we give them that we were recommended from our vet to give them. So they love these. Um, they get one a day. I just fed them that big old high, that big old tree. Um, so I'm gonna put this off to the side. I've got an open bag that I'm gonna give them one. Set this off to the side here, quick. Oh. All right, come on, boys. Okay, so like I said, um, these are the exact treats we give them. These are the exact same thing that uh, you guys gave me. So thank you very much. Um, these are not very cheap. These are like a buck a piece. Come on, up, up. You want a treat? Come on. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. All right. But they get one a day, and uh, they didn't get theirs yet today, did you? So we'll give them to you. You guys like this? It smells like musty car meets, I don't know. It doesn't smell that great. Um, Hey, don't you do that. Twirl, how we twirl? Good boys, up, up. Now let's sit, let's sit, let's no, sit, sit, sit. Good boy, Monty, now let's sit pretty. Sit pretty, Monty, Ruger's doing it, sit pretty. And then speak, now you can speak. Good boy, Ruger, speak, Monty. Good boy, Monty, good boys. Yeah, they love those things. Yeah, so awesome, thank you very much once again. I don't know if it's if they're really helping Monty's breath, but they're definitely helping his teeth stay clean. Yeah, I don't know. It's 
it doesn't it's not even the chewing process with those it's the uh i think whatever the ingredient or, or something it's it's something something in there is good for them i'm not a scientist or a whatever i need to be to understand what makes it good anyways awesome thank you very much once again you know who you are um and also my coffee is done yeah all right got my got my little cute little pink ugly face monty's ugly face smile pretty face ugly handsome face uh mug here <laughs> smells good smells like coffee Oh yeah, it's hot. Mmm, that's some good coffee. Mm. Yeah, thank you very much for that, some good stuff. Okay, we have got two more packages. I know what both these are. We are going to save this one for last because we all know what hot is. And this one, I'm kind of excited for. This one is from Nancy. Be careful with this one. You guys don't know what's in here. I gotta be. Yeah. Gotta be careful with that knife, you know what I mean? <laughs> That's great. Oh, it's awesome. <laughs> oh. Awesome. All right, hold on. We got to get a, a nice shot of this one. Sweet. think <laughs> that's pretty sweet we got a pet portrait awesome looks just like them okay awesome been waiting for this one so yeah we got a portrait for Monty and of Monty and Ruger here this is from Nancy Houston pet portraits uh, I'm gonna be posting a link in the description of the video to her uh, Facebook page and yeah that's awesome looks great looks just like them Notice how even the attention to detail, you've got Ruger's blue and brown eyes with the little blacks in there, and then my eyes are just black like space with just only the reflections of what looks into them, but absorbs all, most light. <laughs> awesome, so thank you very much once again. Have to get a nice frame for that one, eh boys? Huh? What do you think, Monty? It's like, it's, it's not food. I don't understand the point of it. And Ruger's like, it's not a toy. Awesome. I want to keep this one over here. But yeah, thank you very much once again. Yeah, so uh, one other quick thing I wanted to mention is uh, the Nancy Houston Pet Portraits. She mentions that she ships worldwide. So be sure to check out her Facebook page, which like I said, I will link in the description. And yeah, as you can see, that's great. Um, looks just like them. Good job. Thank you very much. Not too good at boogies. These guys are unentertained by the art. I like the art. <laughs> they just want, they want the treats. <laughs> they want the treats and the toys. All right, boys. We're going to finish strong here. Nope. All right. Okay. All right. We've got one final package, and it is the Bark Box. We got the Bark Box, boys, for the Barky Boys. Watch out. Watch out there. Don't get all hot and bothered. You're gonna get it. All right, what do we got today? What's the password? It's got night at the squeak easy <laughs> So we've got looks like a bottle of rum or triple X and uh, a spider
Well, let's get these off here. Ruger always goes tra crazy for the toys. I'm sure you can see in the backyard there with that clip earlier. There's just toys that have been getting uncovered with the snow that he lost. Which one are you, Amante? Oh, Rugs, don't be so dramatic. Okay. Which one are you, Amante? This one? You want the spider? All right, get him, Amante. There you go. We're trying to. Ruger's in. Ruger, you got this? You got this? Get it, Rugs. Get him, Monty. Get him, Monty. What, did you bring it back, Monty? Did you bring it back? You got the Spidey? Get him, Monty. Remember, you already got one in your mouth. <laughs> Rugus, Monty, did he steal both the toys? Go get him, Monty. Go get him, Rugs. Get the other one. Go get it! Bring it here, Monty. Bring it here, Rooks. Go ahead, Monty. Bring it here! Yeah, good boy, Rooks. Get it. Oh, oh, simmer down. Don't break a leg. Monty, bring it here. Okay. Well, Rooks will destroy those by the end of the day. <laughs> Loves ripping out those squeakers. I don't know what it is. His great joy is just, you know, destroying the toys. Okay, so we've got some treats in here, boys. We have got a Thinker's Real Sticks chicken recipe stick thingy. We've got a duck soup, and we've got a fish flask. Um, I think Monty picked out the last treat, so we're gonna let Ruger choose this time. Ruger, come here. Come here, Rugs. Come here, Rugs. Come here. Come here, Rugs. You want a treat? Come here. Come here. Up, up. Okay. Sit down. Stay. Okay, you ready? Touch. This one. <laughs> he knows that command. He went with the duck soup. All right, boys. You want a treat? You want a treat? Who wants a treat? Oh, we've got some nice little... It smells like... It smells like kind of like beef jerky. I ain't going to taste them because they don't look right. For me, they're dog treats. They're not for me. I won't eat your guys' treats, I promise. I've eaten them before, but not today. You know, this does... Looks eerily similar, similar to that vegan jerky I tried a while back. <laughs> right? Alright, up, up. Once a treat. Whoa, Rubes. Okay, well, let's twirl. Twirl. Good boys. Alright, let's twirl again. Let's twirl again. That was good. Come on, Monty, twirl. Twirl, Monty. Twirl. Twirl. Oh, the second time confused him. All right, fine. Uh, lay down. Lay down. Down. Lay down. Monty, lay down. Lay down. Okay. All right, now let's see if I can balance it on your nose. You want... This is something we've never tried on camera. Stay. 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 Leave it. Wait, 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 wait. Monty, wait, wait, wait. Monty, wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 Monty. Let me just... Good boys. Stay. We're going to stay. Stay. <laughs> They're not getting it. Okay, speak. Speak. Okay, good boy. Speak. 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 Jesus, this is not. Speak. 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 Good boy. There we go. All right. Ruger, come here. Oh, lap dog here. All right, we're just gonna give you these ones. You're good boys. Okay. All right, good boys. Okay. Oh. Well, anyways, yeah. Thank you very much for all the stuff, guys. Uh, yep. Yeah, they love the bark boxes as usual, and uh, Bunty is uh, not satisfied with the amount of treats he has gotten this day. They've been eating lots of treats. Uh, I get they get sent a lot of treats each of each of these unboxing videos and we uh, They get a little spoiled let's say and it, it creates habits like this no, look at him. He's just eating my finger now The heck Monty not everything's a treat. Okay, so I Think that's gonna wrap this one up here um, You know got another late Sunday upload. Sorry about that. We're recording it today, but it happens uh, We're gonna be getting out in the woods real soon we're going to be very upset 
until they hopefully change the rules and I can go canoe camping at my favorite spot. And if they don't, then I'm going to just be real upset and frustrated and uh, just deal with it. That's what's going to happen. So that was the last rant of the whole can't go to my favorite spots thing. And uh, we'll figure it out. So anyways, thank you very much for uh, all the stuff once again, guys. And uh, I'll catch you in the next video. Have a good one. Oh!